Hey there guys, Anime Fate back again. So today I'm doing another unboxing, but it's gonna be a Funko unboxing. This is the new Funko Ultimate Unboxing Box. Uh this is the 2020 version. Uh I got this at GameStop because I was up there yesterday on Friday. And while I was up there, I thought, you know what, why don't I stop in at GameStop, get some stuff. And this was one of the things that I got. And it's actually really cool because I've never opened it. And when I was asking the attendants, all they said was it's, you know, like it says on the tag on the box right there, it's 30 bucks for like $10. So I thought, you know, what's $10? And so I bought it. And... I still haven't opened it because I wanted to, you know, make a make a video for this. So Oh, that's pretty cool. So, first things first. There's a Five Nights at Freddy's Glow Pizzeria Simulator vinyl figure. It's like a mystery box. I'll show the characters on the back here. Let me get it straightened out here. Next we have, oh well, that's cool. A Marvel Loki Pop Pez Dispenser. That's pretty cool. And then lastly, oh. Harry Potter Fox, the Phoenix. That's really cool. And then we have the big pop. Or I shouldn't say the big pop, the regular pop at the bottom, which we have Venomized Rocket Raccoon. That's cool. That's really cool. So I'm going to go ahead and start with pulling him out of the box. That's actually really cool. It's very unique. Uh, he's actually really, really cool. I like the blasters on the arms. I like like the colors, you know, the, the blacks, the silver, and the purple. That's really cool. I do have another Venomized. Well, I technically have two more. I have... Venomized Miles Morales, and then I have Venomized, uh, gosh, Carnage. That's his name. Yeah, Venomized Carnage. And I'll probably show those at the end of the video along with him. Uh, he's actually, like I said, he's really cool. Yeah. I always forget that they're bobbleheads, you know? I always forget that these ones are actually bobbleheads. But yeah, that's really cool. I really like the design that they put into them. I do wish that he came with a stand, because he is a little top-heavy and he goes forwards, you know? But other than that, you know, I'm really happy with him. I might honestly probably just make, like, a custom stand for him. It wouldn't be that hard. And then on the back of the box, we have these six. And the Venomized Storm and Daredevil, I think, would probably be the ones that I want the most out of the collection. I think probably the Groot would be last. Thanos in front of Groot. And then, uh, 
Hmm. He's supposed to be Wolverine, but it says X-23. Oh, that's the girl. Okay. Never mind. Yeah. So, those are pretty cool, though. I do like the Venomized series. It's very cool. It's very creative, you know. Uh, I do want the Venomized Doctor Strange, simply because I actually have a Ghost Rider Doctor Strange as well. And that'd be cool to go together, along with the Astral Form, which I'm still looking for. So, the next thing we're going to open up is the... Uh, Five Nights at Freddy's. I'm personally not like a big fan of the game. I mean, I've watched some YouTubers play it, but on a personal note, I've never had like a want or need to play it. All right. That's pretty cool. I don't know what his name is, but he's like a little beaver with a sombrero playing the guitar. Huh. Very cool. Again, I don't know the franchise. I've never paid too much attention to it. So I don't know who and or what exactly he is. And yeah, please forgive me for that. I Like I said, I don't play enough of it or watch enough of it to really know. And then we have Fox, the Phoenix. And if I'm correct, this is uh, I am drawing a blank on his name. Uh, the headmaster. I swear, I am. I am just drawing a blank. You know, I'm not like a like a super huge Harry Potter fan, so uh, I I do apologize about not remembering some of the names. Um, but here he is. I will say, he's actually got a really cool design. There's a lot of attention to detail here, which makes me very happy. I'm still so stuck on the fact that I can't remember his name. I start, and I've watched all the movies. I've read a couple of the books, and I just I can't remember his name. I know he's the headmaster. I know Harry, the whole Gryffindor situation. Uh, it, it's not coming to me. I don't know why. Well, you know what? Why don't you guys put down in the comments his name for me? With a couple other things, you know, maybe if you guys... Uh, maybe if you guys, you know... Like the video, uh, things that you would like to see more often, uh, or anything else like that. And thank you guys for watching the video. You know, I always, I'm always very grateful for anyone who watches the videos. And I'm hoping it's getting you guys through all this. So thank you, and I hope you guys have an awesome time. And I will see you guys in the next video.